we know when we play teams like St. John's going into the weekend, it's going to come down to the last pitch. I mean, the, the, to think that we're just going to get up 10 to 2 and they're just going to lay down, that's not going to happen. I mean, that they're just too good of a team. And so we knew that they were going to make a run a lot like you see in most basketball or football games. Um, we just had to, you know, keep our, keep our poise about us, keep playing the game, stay pitch to pitch. And I thought our guys did a tremendous job of that. Um, you know, for Jackson Boss to come in there in that tight spot and strand those base runners, then Colby Bruce to come in and not have his best stuff in that eighth inning and then go back out there with the game on the line in the ninth with only a two-run lead and look like his usual self and punch out two of the three hitters. And, you know, um, that was great to see. And that's not easy to do. As a coach, as you see it's kind of some inner competition unfolding, like you see Bryce go out there on Friday and throw the ball really well and then... Um, you just you see Chance get the ball on Saturday, and he wants to try to do better. And then Andrew gets the ball on Sunday after watching the opposing team um, and how Bryce and Ryan have attacked those hitters, and he tries to do better. So um, the inner competition is fun to watch on the coaching side of things and just really proud of how those guys have performed so far. This past weekend, we had offensive production kind of leaders each and every game from one or two different guys. So um, that's... That's something positive that we, we would like to see continue and um, you know, make it as hard as possible to write out the lineup each day. That's what you want. Our non-conference schedule is going to be filled with teams that have won national championships like Coastal Carolina or played in Super Regionals like East Carolina and those types of things. So um, you know, that's why, I think that's why our guys you know, chose to come to Charlotte is to play in these environments and have these opportunities. So I'm just excited for them to, to do so.